Genital warts are caused by the human papillomavirus, or HPV, which can be spread through sexual contact, either oral, vaginal, or anal sexual contact. And a person can have warts and not even know they have them. So because of this, if they continue to have multiple sexual partners, that increases the chances that they're catching it because it can be spread when the person doesn't even know that they have it. So you mentioned that you have a friend who has suspicions that he might have genital warts and it would be best for him to go to the doctor and get checked out and also any sexual partners that he's had. The doctor can perform an exam and look closely at the different bumps and lumps that your friend has noticed and see if they are indeed genital warts. And if, they're, if they are, then there are things they can do to reduce the number of warts, although there really is no way to treat them. They, the, the virus stays in the body and can pop up over different times in a person's life. They can be taken care of by laser therapy or chemical treatment, and again, the doctor can decide if treatment is warranted in your friend's situation. Once a person has the HPV virus, there is a chance that it could contribute to cancers later in life, and so the doctor may also talk to your friend about this implication as well. Whenever you're going to engage in sexual relations with a partner, you should always think about preventing pregnancy and also about sexually transmitted infections. By using a condom, it does decrease the chance of catching genital warts, although genital warts can be found on parts of the genital area that aren't covered by a condom. But it does reduce the chance of that and other infections, so it's always a good idea to think about using a condom when you engage in sexual behaviors. Good luck with everything, and if you have any other questions for me in the future, feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash Intermountain Moms and recommend us to your friends and family too.